Don't walk away. Don't walk away. I'm teaching you manners, you frickin' Neanderthal. Well, well, well. Twitter celebrity sighting. The West Side curmudgeon is here. I love him. He hates the things we hate and tweets about it. Should I go over and fangirl out on him? Oh, I wouldn't. Okay, well, we're different. <laughs> Well, Grace finds all sorts of new love interests in the new season of NBC's Will and Grace, including one played by David Schwimmer, who plays a very un like character, hard to believe. We love a crossover. We got to tell you, Deborah Bessie, welcome to us from New York. How yes, are you? Good morning. I'm great. How are you guys doing? Do you want to start with the breastfeeding or we'll get to that later? <laughs> oh, I, I, I did my, I did enough breastfeeding. I'm good. <laughs> um, okay, we're so excited about David Schwimmer coming in here. When we say un we're thinking about you. Did you even watch, watch Friends? Because you were busy doing Will and Grace. Yeah. No, I mean, they, they were on four years before we started. I was a big Friends fan, so for yeah. sure. So we heard, yeah, and we heard from Eric that he almost, I guess, became, or that Ross almost, or Schwimmer almost became Will. We heard today that Tiffany's saying she tried out for Rachel. Did anybody try out for Grace that you know of? Um, I think half of Hollywood. Yeah. Tried yeah. Out for but like anybody like closely there with you. I think mm -hmm. didn't Karen? I think that. Or oh the, yes, Megan did. Megan Mullally was Megan, almost uh, Megan auditioned or for Deborah, it. Deborah, did yeah. you ever audition for Friends? Did you? Were there any almosts for you for any of the I, main characters? I auditioned. I auditioned for Rachel. See? Oh, we were guessing right at, who you right could have. You guys right out of graduate school. Wow. Wow. So you guys yeah. were just running into each other in all the auditions. I and know. Look at you now. Wait, okay. Deborah, how far did you get on the Rachel front? A uh, zero. <laughs> no. How's that possible? I think you could have made a good Phoebe, though. Thank you. You would have made a really Thank cute you. Phoebe. But I, I think Grace I'm Adler, having a good time playing Grace. Grace <laughs> yes. Let me tell you, Deborah, I was watching Will and Grace on, the, on my flight here. L-O-L-ing. I know I was making everyone around me very upset. I was like, look, you guys can watch it too. I was just laughing out loud. It's so funny. I'm so I, glad. I can't wait for the new season. Yeah, it's um, really held up. The writing is. It's so it's, good. Yeah. Dare I say even they're, better? It's they're, even better. They're, yeah, they're so smart, and uh, we laugh every single day on set, and it's, it's incredible. I mean, it's, this, this year is 20 years since the pilot. Wow. Wow. So 20 years. That's amazing. We can tell so, that you guys are having so much fun. And so, okay, so this season we're going to see Grace with a new love interest played by David Schwimmer. It's a very right. un Ross like character. Tell us a little bit more about David Schwimmer's character. Uh, he's called the West Side uh, Curmudgeon, <laughs> and he is a blogger. And uh, he's a pessimist, and he's complicated, and it's a very adult uh, relationship. It's 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 thorny and and sexy, and I think it's going to be fun. I love it. So this, I, yeah. we've heard he's going to be on for about five episodes or so. So this is love. It, it something's happening. Something oh. something's happening. Harry oh. Connick right, is upset. We're yeah. moving okay. on. Um, what about for you guys, Deborah? Getting back together. We've asked this question before, but to the point of watching it now, I feel like it's almost better. Yeah. The writing, everything it sharper. Feels, it feels better. I think the only thing that was a concern coming back after 11 and a half years was, okay, how do I look? Um, you know, because it's it's a long time, mm -hmm. and uh, so there were concerns about okay. I got my hair, my, my red hair back. That was, that was number one, because it was brown from doing Dirty Dancing. And um, I, I started eating really, really, really clean and just really focused on, on getting my health in check. Um, and, uh, you know, the other thing was getting the smile, keeping the smile, because Grace is a smiler. And, um, and that's why I partnered with uh, Colgate Optic White because it's something that I've used for years and years and years. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, and it's 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 just great. It works for me. I've got I've got no time. I'm a single mom. I've got no time for things that don't work, and uh, and it and it works for me. So it was just a matter of trying to like put the boat back together again. I think there's <laughs> something in the water over there, at Will and Grace, though, because all of you all look, look if not the same, you look better. Even better. So Thank you. what is the secret? Maybe it's all that laughing or the prayers you all say with each other before oh, you. Oh, it's do the your grinding. Show. It's it's all of it. It's all of it. No, Definitely what, drinking yeah. drinking lots and lots and lots of water for sure. But yeah. um, laughing laughing goes a long way to uh, to making you look better. And you just celebrated. We should say a kind of a big deal birthday. So happy birthday.
Thank you. I turned 50. Yes. Oh, 50 and you fabulous. Wouldn't know. And I, you yes. know what? And I, and I feel really good. I do. I look back. I look back at pictures from, you know, when, I, when we started Will and Grace. Yeah. And Lord knows my hair is very different. Right. Yeah. Um, but, uh, you know, I, I, I'm a little curvier. Uh, and nothing wrong with my, that, Deborah. N nothing wrong with that, but my wow. my teeth are just as bright now as they were when I was 30. So yeah. that's that's a and, good thing. And by the way, like, aren't you in a? I feel like your 50s. You know, you're kind of in a better place in your life. Like, would you take your 20s it. back? No. No. Yeah. No. 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 This this feels this feels better than than 30 or 40 for sure. Wow. Oprah wow. always promised that. She said, "Ladies, it gets better in your yeah. 50s." I've got two more years yeah. to go, but I feel it.